So the Japanese model, Jessica Michibara, was found with drugs in her purse and uh, she was arrested. Apparently, she left uh, this bag uh, when she arrived at the airport uh, to have it sent to her room in a hotel. In this bag, the were contained all the drugs. Just this it makes it kind of hilarious. Something that you wouldn't want to leave to somebody else to carry because it could be checked. So it's very, very naive that you would do something like this. This is a model that if you go to her Wikipedia page, you can only find three things. When she was born, when she got married because her partner was a famous uh, F Formula One pilot, and when she was found with the drugs. And this to me, it's really sad. I mean, think about it. This is a woman who has money, who has fame, and she decides to spend her time doing drugs. Even more like bringing it from a different country I mean, that's insane, right? She's 38. She's not even like you would say somebody who's in her 20s who can make these mistakes because we all done mistakes in our 20s. So she's a grown woman. And to me, to waste her life like this, uh, to do drugs, it's a sign of really the more general conditions of women in their 30s nowadays. If you consider also that she was married to this Formula One pilot, and her marriage only lasted one year after she received this $250,000 worth of ring. Just one year, and that was it. And then she dated uh, this uh, Hollywood producer. That's the other thing, you know, wh why do these women always have to marry you know, either super famous guys or incredibly rich producers? Uh, uh, can they just for once fall in love uh, with... Uh, somebody who's just a normal person. And this is very typical of women. Okay, they've done a study uh, on matching apps and they've seen that basically almost all the women considered 80% of men uh, just average. They wouldn't date them. All these women, they want to go and aim for the top, for the very top. But then we see the results in front of our eyes. This 30-year-old woman is apparently cannot find peace with herself. Uh, she apparently has a daughter. So imagine uh, this mother, successful, who's got a lot of money, who's been associated with very important people, but she's still doing drugs. She's almost 40 and she's doing drugs and probably spending her time, what, watching Netflix? This is what's really, really sad. You know, I talked to a lot of women in their 30s here in Japan and they pretty much are very similar. They always aim for the top guy with the highest salary, with the best jobs. They never seem to look for, for what constitute the, the essential points of a relationship, which could be uh, if you're attracted to each other other than material things. She was offering her beauty and she was getting back a lot of exposure in the media by dating these very famous people and of course also material wealth. But this way, it's not how you build a solid relationship. And a matter of fact, this relationship, they all ended very quickly. But I want to hear your opinion. Tell me what you think about what's happening to this uh, model, to this Japanese model. Why do they have to resort to drugs? Is that boredom? Is that fatigue? Because this to me all looks very, very sad.